What's up, Hatch Tribe? Hello, how are you? Uh, so first off, I wanna say, this is the second week I'm trying the video newsletter to you, and I really mean it. I wanna hear from you. Do you like this? Do you dislike it? Would you rather me go back to writing you a letter? I'm okay with whatever. Let me know though, I'd love to hear your feedback. So, without further ado, let's jump in. We have three quick messages today. One, we're gonna talk about daylight savings time. Two, we're gonna talk about something awesome that's happening inside the member circle. And three, we're gonna talk about an event that's coming up. Okay, first things first. Daylight savings time, this is real, y'all. So if you woke up feeling the struggle bus, oh my God, you are not alone. It turns out science backs the fact that what we are experiencing is real. Last night, so when we did the time change, you actually lost 40 minutes of sleep. It's just the reality. You didn't sleep well, your body, your circadian rhythm is not on the right path right now, but it will be. But before we get there, two interesting facts you might wanna know. There's a 5.7% increase in injuries on the Monday following daylight savings time. So if that's not your lesson to just stay safe today, <laughs> I don't know what is. Number two, there is a 6% increase in car crashes immediately following daylight savings time. Um, might be the week to stay at home and work if you're able, right? So stay safe out there, folks. But the reality is we have to get through this. We manage to do this every single year, but there are a couple tips and tricks that will help you do that with better ease. Let me share them with you. One, as soon as you get up and as soon as the sun comes up, spend some time in front of the sun. It helps get your circadian rhythm back on track. So if you can eat breakfast and just take in a little sunlight, do that. Number two, avoid caffeine after lunch. And sister, I hear you. There's that desire to want to pick up that cup of coffee and go out and have a little nooner. Or later in the afternoon, don't do it this week. Do not take a nap this week either. And I know I'm a person who touts the benefits of naps and I love them. But this week while our body's adjusting, just ditch the nap. And last thing, if you are sleep deprived, do not drive. I feel like that's our, uh, our message of the day. <laughs> Okay, now let's talk about the other things. So this week inside the member circle, Mickey Kerwick, our mentor of the month, coach for Own the Room, is teaching us about executive presence. So what that means is what is happening with your body when you're talking to any audience, whether you're talking to customers, clients, meeting new networking contacts, coming to a Hatch Tribe event, because your words only account for 7% of the entire package of communication. What the heck's happening with the other 93? Mm, good question. So if you want to learn more about that, get in the Hatch Tribe Members Circle. So you can join by going to hatchtribe.com backslash members circle. And the question I've been getting is, do you have to join for the year? No, you totally can. You save money by doing so. And if that's important to you, bravo. But you can also join for a month and get in there and start to get a feel for what it's like. And we hope to earn your business every single month because we're bringing you some badass content. And I can tell you the next several months are on point. We're about to announce all of them and there's some cool stuff that's coming, so stay tuned. And last thing this week is that we have a live event in Charleston coming up next week. It's Women Entrepreneurs Hour. It's happening on Tuesday, March 20th in the morning with three incredible entrepreneurs. Dee Ruel, she's a jeweler. Emily Cox, she's an associate architect who specializes in interiors. And Grace Newland, she makes tortillas for Meet La Tortilleria. And all three of them are gonna talk about lessons they've learned what type of legacy they're building towards and what they've learned and how they've had to lead in order to be able to be successful in their businesses. All of them are brilliant and I can't wait for you to get to know them. So join us. That's happening next week on Tuesday, March 20th. Get your tickets at hatchtribe.com slash gatherings. All right, that's it. So go out, kick some ass, girl. You've got this. And I'll talk to you very soon. And seriously, do you like this thing? Shoot me a message back. Let me know. Okay, bye.